Hello, hello, it's Tracy from Gift Basket Appeal and Mindless Crafting, and I'm super excited, y'all. We got happy, happy, happy mail today. <laughs> ah, yes, the stamp set that y'all have been waiting for has arrived, and Bill is here with me. Yes, I am. I'm here with Hartley. So let's see who's here. Hey, I see a bunch of you coming in. Madeline Rodriguez, Teresa Church, how are you? Sabrina's Two Sweet Creations is in the house. Yes, this was just like, this has not been a normal week, y'all. This has just not been a normal week. It was just, it's just a di very different week for us. So we're super excited. Normally, we would not release two stamp sets in one week. <laughs> That's just not, you know, it's just... Well, we've got so many emails planned. threatening our lives saying, you better put Hartley <laughs> out there. No, we, we said that if the shipment comes in, then we would go ahead and not hold back on it and put it right out there for y'all. So, we got Puerto Rico is in the house, the Caribbean, let's see who that is. Blondell is here. Nishima. And Shima Phillips, we might be yes. related. Yes, Yvette Pierce is here too. So we've been really busy, y'all, because since we released our stamp set on Wednesday, our first stamp set, um, which was the Spring Blossom, we showed you a preview of the other stamp set that we've been waiting for today. So uh, many of y'all have named the dog and everything, okay? <laughs> y'all named him Hartley. So he brought, Hartley brought some friends with him. So I'm going to go ahead and reveal. Bill has already uh, put it in the store. As soon as it came in, he put it in the store. Um, so we just wanted to make sure that everything was okay. All the links were working. And so we're ready, babe? Oh, yes. We're ready. Okay. Here is the Love You stamp set. And, of course, here's Hartley. Let me show you what this has. This is Hartley on the on the stamp set. So this is him and this is his friends. The teddy bear, <laughs> the cat. Someone asked us about a cat. So we wanted to put a cat on this stamp set as well. And then we actually have on this stamp set, it has uh, five sentiments and nine images for you to play with and color in. So I'm, I've got some cards that I want to show y'all that I made. But before I do that, I want y'all to see what this looks like stamped out. So um, some of you have already gotten the first stamp set. We mailed it out on Wednesday because we like to mail stuff as soon as we uh, get orders in. We like to get it out as soon as possible. So let me show you what these look like stamped out. And look how crisp and clean they are. Great for coloring in. And I wanted each one to hold a heart. Look at the teddy bear. Oh my goodness, y'all. So much fun with this teddy bear. But heart, I have to tell you, Hartley, the heart dog, <laughs> he has really been such a favorite. Y'all fell in love with him that y'all went ahead and named it. The stamp set is called the Love You stamp set. But y'all went and and named Hartley. So we, Bill and I have been referring it to the Hartley stamp set. That's what we've been naming it. So um, the nice thing about this stamp set is we were going to hold on to it and not release it until next year. So we weren't going to release it until 2020. And so uh, Bill had a good idea. We both talked about it and we said, you know what? Love is all year round. You don't have to wait for a day to show someone that you love them. So I, I'm expecting y'all to make Hartleys <laughs> and I guess we need to name the cat and the bear. <laughs> We need to name them also. We want y'all to be using this all year round. So let me just show you some of the other things that I stamped out on here. What you do have is you'll have this little banner and you're going to be able to create things using that little banner. You can use that over and over and over again. And that's how I, I designed some of my cards that I'm going to show you today. You've got the heart with the scalloped edges around it. 
And it's got, look what it's got, y'all. It's got stitching. You know I couldn't help it. <laughs> I just couldn't help it. The bear's heart, it has stitching. I mean, it is what it is, y'all. It's the thing I love. So I, I'm sure y'all are going to appreciate that. And then we also have the um, arrow, right? So you got stuff. This I see as patterns. I can make patterns for cards. So those are some of the ideas I'll be showing you how to make backgrounds for your cards. If you don't have the, the paper that matches the theme, you can make your own. You can make your own. Yep. And then this is another heart. And I want you to really see this. This heart has little tiny circles. I call it a Hollywood heart or a heart with lights around it. It looks like little uh, lights. So I want y'all to be able to see that. Clean designs. Nice for coloring in. The sentiment, bless your heart. Super cute. And here's where I started coloring in some of this stuff. Now you get, you get a circle that has a heart. This is one stamp. Um, I can see this on like an envelope type um, project where you just take this, you cut this out, and you put this on as a seal or something. I'm sure close up an envelope. Of I know, right? There's so many ideas going through my head. So what are people saying, babe? I, I don't see the oh, Hello, they're so good. They're cute and stuff like that. Uh, hello. One of the most everywhere, Puerto Rico, oh, nice. Caribbean, New York, Alabama. People say, Look, Tracy, stop talking. Let's see this. Thing. <laughs> and just finally started showing Brian Dickey. Yeah. Hello, we have uh, congratulations, thank you. Love your stamp site. Oh my god, so cute and adorable. Tammy O'Kane is on. Hi, Tammy. Hey, Tammy. Bargy Ryan says, Loves the Belinda Waters. Too cute. Diane 57, she says, There's my puppy. Yep, he's here. Hartley. Anama Rahu says, Beautiful. And now, now you've also says, I need this. You've also got the BU stamp on it, too. Yes, so, this is, this is one of the biggest things. I wanted this to be on the stamp, and this is a message that you can give to anybody is to be you. You, you know don't what? have, and, and I put it with a heart because I want you to also love yourself. So when I put be you, I, that heart is meant for something. So whenever you're stamping out that, just get that reminder that love yourself as well as just not just being you. Right. And not only that, if you look at the, each word and kind of reflect on it, be. First, you have mm -hmm. to be. Right. Be above all. And then when you decide to be finally, be you. <laughs> be you. And then add all those parameters with that heart that Tracy talked about. It, there you, know. you go. <laughs> and then, of course, the XOXO, and you'll see how I use that in one of the projects um, that I made for you, some samples that you can see. And then, of course, these important words, I love you. Don't save it for Valentine's. <clears throat> I love you is all year round. Right, babe? Yes, it is. There you go. So let me show you. I've been a coloring fiend, okay? <laughs> Look, I told you this week I had a tooth pulled. And uh, what else? Oh, I broke my glasses. This was a week, wasn't it? Yes. Yeah. You had something with the jaw. You yeah, had a little bit of pain in my jaw. I'm like, all of these little, little issues. Bit. Okay. So, I yeah. So, the wall. Okay. so, yeah. So, this is, um, I just decided to color Heart Dog in different colors. And here I just decided to have some fun and have some little polka dots going on there. I wanted the little cat in different colors, different shades. So you can really play around with this. There's no limits to all of the different things that you can do with this stamp set. And of course, right here, if you see um, the bear, what a bear holding the heart, Bill, that's just priceless. I mean, you just, you got to have a bear with the heart. And then look at this. This actually... And this are the same thing. Let me just show you. Hi, Yasmin from Egypt. I love to have um, stamps that have like uh, make you can make borders. So because I like to make borders, I wanted to share that with you. And so look at this border right here. That's this this stamp that can go like a side border, like right along your card. But I also have one like this so you can just do straight across and just connect them when you're putting your card together. So isn't that just the cutest look you at look that. like you have a circle thing. And then this one right here, it's like a half 
half circle, right? It looks yeah. like that. Let me show you how I did that. I was just kind of playing I was around. Wondering where that thing was? <laughs> Bill, was like, that? Bill was like, that didn't go on the stamp set. <laughs> uh, I'm, trying to modify. I'm trying to do some different stuff with y'all here. Okay, so this is actually all I did was took this stamp and just curved it. So you can curve it as much as you want. Just, just barely curving it like that. Y'all don't understand. Sometimes it looks a certain way. It doesn't always have to be that way, right? So imagine if I wanted to do a border on this. Are y'all with me here? I just discovered this too. This wasn't like... Uh, <laughs> Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Just want y'all to see that. I'm just barely bending it just a little bit. So what are my crafty friends saying, babe? No, I yeah. Say yeah. Okay, here we go. Look at that. That's how I got the curve on there. And then I just colored it in. And then you, if you want, let me just make sure I wipe this off. Just go back to the straight line again. So you got versatility with this. Okay. Just going to stamp it straight. I'm really inking. I can't find my smaller block. It's somewhere on this desk, y'all. <laughs> somewhere. <laughs> so that's just to show y'all what you can do with that stamp. You can do a long, just... Just keep going, continuous hearts, and it's got heart with stitching in between it, or you can kind of curve oh, it. Oh, that's cute. That's the other thing. Brian Dickey, Dickey says, as Harley would say, I choose you. C-H-E-W-S. <laughs> oh, <laughs> that is so cute. Vivian Kirkland says, very lovable. Oh. Like Barry. Yes. The Quilter Marine is on here. Hey, Quilter Marine. Yeah, so I wanted to make sure we got this out to you before the weekend um, so that you can see it. Donna Southern says she just bought her stamp set. Oh, nice. She has to go, though. Okay, you take care, Donna. They're predicting 14 inches of snow. Oh, my goodness. So look at all of this wonderful goodness to color in. So this is what I'm going to be doing. Y'all know what I'm going to be doing this weekend. Let me show you the cards I did with these. Now, y'all have seen these two cards. For some of you that may be tuning in for the first time, may not have seen these. But look at this. Now, this right here is just this here over and over and over. And then I just cut it out as one banner. So I'll be showing you that in the video. Here's Hartley again. Look at that. There's the banner again. This is just one banner. Rather than cutting them out individually, I just did straight across. Adorable. And actually, this may not be Hartley. This may be who? Hartina? I don't know. <laughs> she, she's pink with, um, and she's got some sparkly stuff. Let me see if y'all so can see that. So we all think we should name her. Name her. Hartina. <laughs> Ah, Harteria. I don't know. Look how cute. I added a little bit of sparkle to her right around her feet. I don't know if y'all can see that. <laughs> ah, what is... Hartlet. Oh, Hartlet, Hartlet. Harletta. <laughs> Harletta. <laughs> ah. I love the name Hartley too. So this is Hartley right here. And I added some sparkle to their noses. The face is just super cute, y'all. And then let me show you. You got the bear. And these are very versatile. And then you've got, here's the cat, the little gray cat. And yeah, so it's I, cute. I just used the XOXO. And then I just took my banner and cut it and put it right below here, each one. I put everything kind of off kilter on that. Added some sparkly stuff to that. Needed some shimmer on that one. 
Isn't that so cute? And then I shimmered his heart. Hartley's heart. Right. And I don't know if all of the look, I'm calling him, but it could be a her, right? Little That's kitty. True. Little kitten. So someone had asked us about a cat. Am I in frame there? Yeah. Yes. Someone had asked us about a cat, and so I knew we had already had that on this stamp set. <laughs> yeah, so we are super excited. Super excited about this. So, we have, so what is it? So we have 77 people on. People on. Brian Dickey says he started making Valentine cards for his friends last night. Since I have five dogs, I decided upon the I choose you. <laughs> I think that is so funny. <laughs> ah, that is Marjorie funny. Ryan says, what's that block you put it on? Oh, that is my mounting block. And it comes in different sizes. This is a medium one. Here's the longer. These stay on my desk. These are mountain block, oh, mounting blocks. This is a small one. Then you have a huge one over there. And that allows you to put your stamp right on here. And the nice thing about this one, it has a grid on it. What's beautiful about these particular stamps, the, the photopolymer stamps, they're not coming off that block, believe me. They're not sliding or nothing, but they come off e easily when you pull them off, but they're not coming off. Yeah, they're pretty, pretty much on there. Now, just to let you know, this um, little oval right here, that came from, I was looking for an oval, sh oval shape and I didn't have like a die cut or anything. So I don't have a die do? cutting machine. So I took this, <laughs> the inside of a frame and traced it out to make the oval. Look, you got to use what you have, right? <laughs> That's it. You got to use what you have. So I'm looking forward to playing with these, this stamp set throughout the weekend to get y'all a ton of ideas so that by the time you get your stamp set, um, you'll have a ton of things you can do with them. But I can't wait to see y'all creations. And so let me look at the comments. Yes, Hartley and that, that kitten is so... Adorable. Here's what I was doing, just kind of playing around. So, look, all of these are going to be cards. <laughs> all of these are going to be cards. So, my, for my people who love cats and kittens, there you go. Oh, the ink pad you wanted to know? The ink pad is versifying. Gives you a nice, crisp stamp. Dr. Crowder says she's using versifying ink. Yep. Mumbly Berg says, hello, Harley, so sweet and the kitten so adorable. Your stamp sets are so versatile. I've gotten so many ideas. Yes, that's the thing that I wanted with these stamp sets is I wanted them to be versatile. And because I like to take stamp sets that might be meant for another theme, um, I can now use them to create a whole bunch of other themes just from like you can use these year round. Here's an interesting comment. Tracy surely can comment on this. Margie Ryan says... I wish I was more crafty. And to that, what do you say? Just go ahead and get started. Look, you got some glue, <laughs> got scissors, got a paper, got some paper. There, exactly. there you go. Or anything. Tracy, and mistake, you got, anything. Look, you got you. Cereal That's boxes, your, your most whatever. important toolbox. Your most important tool is you, basically. That uh, that's. I mean, that's it. You just got to get started, you know. If you want to be more crafty, do more crafting. How's that? Yeah, so. And watch a lot of videos. Go on Pinterest. Um, watch a lot of videos. Look at some card layouts that you like. I try to do a lot of simple card layouts because I know a lot of people are beginners. And I do want you to enjoy it. I don't want you to get uh, too frustrated um, when, you're, when you're crafting. So I try to do it in a very calm way. And White says, you have you outdone yourself. Thank so adorable. Thank you so much. Wait till y'all see. 
Wait till y'all see some of the other ideas that we have getting and ready to happen. You, and, <laughs> and yours is on the way. I don't think y'all know. We're already talking about this other stamp set that's coming up, but I we're not even going to give y'all a preview. <laughs> and, not we, on this one. At least I hope not. <laughs> when I say it, and that's like an inside joke. We were on the road heading to uh, the, to this one convention, and uh, it was so funny. And said, when you see me, just say hello. And uh, the next day, we were in the, the cafeteria, and uh, someone came over to him and said, Bill? I said, and it was so funny. It was so funny. I'm reading y'all comments. That's why Tracy was quiet. Yeah. Oh, Too Sweet for BS is on here. How you doing? There you go. Exactly. Don't let anyone tell you otherwise. Yeah, I mean, really. R really. I mean, <laughs> don't, don't let anyone tell you otherwise. Exactly. That you can't do something. You can do more, be more. You're a crafter, period. Ooh, Pat Jones says, I will make one of, one of the... A one sheet mini book and stamp the pages and leave them uncolored for kids to oh, color. Oh, what a good idea! Kids will take that thing and they really create something would. They really thought of in life. Yep, because kids, you can just stamp out some stuff, give them some a pencil, some colored pencils, and they're good to go. Thank you, Liza. She says she just placed her order. Well, they're ready to be ordered. Hey, Liza. Melissa Noble says, can you show the stamp set again? I was oh, late. Oh, yes. Yes, Certainly I can. Yes, I For can. For you, we would do this. Yes. <laughs> ah, here you go, Melissa. There's the stamp. It's a mindless crafting stamp set. This is the Love You stamp set. However, y'all decided to rename it and call it Hartley. Okay? Because Hartley, the heart dog, <laughs> has been like a star all of a sudden. Hartley came out two days ago, and he's an instant star. By the time I got off that live, so many of you were already uh, messaging me about Hartley. <laughs> and when when is he coming out? So um, we got our delivery today. So we're super, ex super excited about this. Oh, too sweet for BS says, I'm good, Tracy and Bill. I am so proud of you both. And to the person who said that they are not crafty, people used to tell me that too. You know what? Yep, you just keep on crafting. Do your thing. Do your thing. If you like those particular colors together, then you put those colors together. Look at all of this. This is just... Believe me, someone on earth will like yep. what you've done. I yep. can promise you this. I love these colors. I just I just love like being able to think outside the box. And I think right now, as far as um, designing these stamp sets, it's it's kind of nice because I can actually see the cards as I'm making them. So it's a little bit different. Like I can actually see the vision of, of what I want the cards to look like uh, when I make my cards. Exactly. Mimi mm -hmm. B, she says, everyone has creativity within them. You just have to wake it up. Yep. You just have to wake, and that's what I'm inspiring y'all to do. I'm I'm here to wake up the inspiration, okay? <laughs> I'm here to help y'all get through whatever, whatever that block is that you're just not, and I'm here to have a good time. I mean, me and Bill have fun with this. This has been a really fun learning process too. Um, so this is new for us. This is something uh, wonderful and new. It's a great journey and I'm just so glad that all of y'all are here with us. Kathy to go Crowder on this journey. says you could take Hartley and create a series like the House Mouse Stamps. Oh wow. Now that's saying now you know what? That's saying a lot because that house mouse stamp, I'm in love with house mouse. And so that is like an honor <laughs> for you to even say that. Like wow. Yeah in 57 says the kitty is cute too but Hartley stole Hartley, the show. Hartley, I know. Hartley is just You know what's so cute about Hartley is if you look closely, you don't have to look closely. <laughs> Everything is a heart. The yeah. ears, the uh -huh. face, the body, yeah, the tail, he's just the so feet. Different. Hartley is so I call him Hartley. Though. Look, Hartley is daring to be different, okay? He's daring to be different. He's going to be himself. Mommy Berg, you're absolutely correct. This is exactly why we named this Mindless Crafting. Mommy Berg says, Mindless Crafting is so wonderful because you don't have to be perfect. 
It's very freeing. I struggled with crafting until I started watching you. If Bill can do it, so can I. Exactly. You know what? I'm the yes. perfect prototype for mindless crafting. I promise you. <laughs> there is no when, mind that goes into what I do. And now when you say be free, it's so freeing. One of our stamp sets in the future is going to have the sentiment, be free. You know, be free in your thinking. Be free in, you know, the way you craft. There's just so many things that we in just... In the way that you be. We become like prisoners inside of our own minds. And so I just want y'all to just think outside the box. If I can sit down here and, and Bill and I can create, stamp, start creating stamp sets, something that's, you know, that we never thought about doing, like maybe <clears throat> how many, a couple of years ago when we started our YouTube channel, this was not like something that we thought about doing. And then because y'all encouraged us, y'all really encouraged us and just kept, kept pushing us and kept just the words and the, the things that you said to us and the encouragement just really kind of said, you know what, we're going to do this. Dan 57 said, you may need a series of Hartley, <laughs> like Hartley in the rain or Hartley taking a train or something like that. <laughs> kind of like... Uh, Hartley in the rain, right? Yeah. We could do it like a birthday Hartley. He can be all kinds of stuff. Then a Hartley at Christmas, you know. Oh my goodness. Let me go get my <laughs> notebook, y'all. Where's my notebook? <laughs> Oh, Yvette Pierce says, how is it doable? But that teddy bear has such a sweet face. Isn't the te his little, you know what? And his little, like right here under his eyes, he's got that nice rounded face. This would be, yeah. this would be cute for a baby shower, wouldn't it? Look how adorable. <laughs> yeah, that, that, um... And you know, I'm, I'm working with different shadings because as you see, I just went very light just around him. So I didn't even color all of him in and he still came out super adorable. So just take a light pastel colored pencil or marker or whatever. And I just went just barely around it and then put a little bit of pink and I did put some sparkly stuff on him too, or her. We need to come up with a name for the bear, huh? <laughs> And then I just, just had fun experimenting with these. Yep. So Bill and I are going to be pretty busy this weekend processing orders. Just processing some orders, you know. So Bill, you reading the comments? Yes, Harley can be like Flat Stanley and show up in all kinds of stamp sets. Oh my goodness. And then Anderson says, I'm going to use Hartley on a birthday card for a friend who loves dogs. Bobby Bear. Are you all shipping international was a question. Well, I answered that early, earlier uh, near the top. Let's see if I can go back. Well, what was the question? Just go ahead. Basically, and what I said was, in a nutshell... Uh, we do ship internationally, but what we found is that the shipping uh, price is relatively steep. So we're yeah. trying to find a different option or some kind of way we can get those down. But I, I mean, the prices are very steep. Yeah, because we really wanted y'all to be able to um, get these stamps. I mean, you can order it, but it's just really high. But it's just it's it's high. So we were actually on Shopify, our Shopify customer service, so we can see what what's available to us. Um, and so we're gonna we're researching different options that we hope to have. Hopefully, we can do something because I would hate to just completely take it down the international. Um, Shipping. I mean, you can leave it up and, you know, but yeah, the, the chances that someone would order, well, the only yeah. way I think a person would order, they would have to order a lot of stamp sets to make it worthwhile, you know, like when we had about 30 of them, because <laughs> the, <laughs> then the price would be worth paying the shipping charge. Yeah, well, yeah, so we're working on it. We're It's a learning curve and, you, and we're, we're going to get it. We're going to get it. Gil We're going to have some kind of solution. Gil Richie says it still might be worth it for those cute stamps. Oh, you have to you're really so sweet. really love them. You, is the Christmas stamp so set sweet. still available? Yes, it, yes is. it is. Yep. So we're just reading the comments, find out what y'all doing, it's, what y'all are saying here. 
and uh, for uh, for Mumley Berg, I'll put the link for that Christmas set in just so you'll have it. It is right there. That's the season's greeting. It's, it'll say season's greeting. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, you, USPS is, um, oh, it's really high prices. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, that's one of the places we're going to look at because that was one of the things they suggested about the ship and getting the shipping costs down lower. So we'll see. Let's see what y'all are saying. I'm just looking at your, um, the site for purchasing is oh www.mindlesscrafting.com. Michelle Kerr says, if I buy two, is the shipping price the same? Yeah, it really is, in all honesty. It's the same price. If you buy two, the shipping price is the same because, I mean, it's going to weigh, one of them weighs about 1.6 ounces. Two of them goes to maybe about 2.4 but it's, you the same, it's the same price, up to about <laughs> five ounces or six ounces. So, can you tell my husband's been really looking at this stuff? We've been re we've been learning a lot, y'all. <laughs> oh, here's a question. Melinda Water says, "Are you going to design more pattern papers?" Yes, we are. We've been struggling fighting these, uh, working on these right here. But we are going to design some more pattern. Yeah, papers. we're yeah we're just focusing on the stamp sets for now. But yes, the pattern as papers soon as I are going to be an down, option. Mimi B says, watch out now, Cinnamon. He's going to wonder what, who's stealing his spotlight. You know what I'm saying? Who? <laughs> Hartley. Hartley is stealing Cinnamon's uh, spotlight, you know? Going to have to make a Cinnamon stamp set, right? Dedicated to Cinnamon. <laughs> oh. So I'm so glad that y'all like this. Um, you, I'm glad you found the link. Good. She says, you guys are the best. Thank you so much. You Well, y'all are the best. Yes. Too. Gil Richie says, I'm coming to the U.S. in two weeks. Can you ship to the hotel? Yes. If you just get the hotel address, put it in there, uh, that'll be the shipping. I believe it'll work. Try it and see what happens. I believe it'll work. Kathy Crowder says, doesn't shipping depend on the weight? Yeah, that's what we thought. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it does depend on the weight. And and, mm -hmm. and the weight for those stamp sets... In, internationally. Yes, but internationally, it has to do with all kind of fees. Yeah. Tariffs, uh, air, fair, all kind of stuff. We were looking at it. Yeah, so we, we are... That's our class this week. How to get shipping costs lower for international. Oh, you haven't been getting notifications for, for our videos? You know what? I notice the same thing to other people that I'm subscribed to. Sometimes I'll get the notification like hours later. Um, I don't know. YouTube I wish YouTube would, would get that like straightened out because when I go live, not everyone's seeing the actual, um, the actual notification for when I go live. They're like, I didn't get the notification until like later, like at the end of your... Um, at the end of our live stream, you know, so, so, yep, we released two stamp sets this week. We are super excited. They're in the store. We've got another one that's in the works. Actually, it's already done, so we got several of them that are already done, but we can't just release all of them at once. We got to let y'all wait a little bit, right? Yes. <laughs> well, actually, what happens is Tracy tests them out thoroughly in all types of configurations. I get to play like before y'all see the stamp sets. I get to play with them because my thing is I've got to make sure that when y'all, when these leave, leave here, that they are stamping out correctly. So I get to play with them before um, they go into manufacturing. Uh, Pat Jones, that's a good question. She's like, I'm wondering if you can blow all these up and print out on fabric to use as appliques for quilts. I don't know. Oh, wow. Iron-ons on, iron on type backing. Wow. 
probably if you scan I would love it, to scan get it in, into uh, Photoshop or something, enlarge it, and uh, print it out to the size you want. I mean, you can find it. There's a way to do it. <laughs> Lioness, you are funny. How about naming the cat Kitty Cat? <laughs> That's what I sound like. There you go. <laughs> Sometimes I just call my dog Dog. Hey, dog. <laughs> And he answers too. Yeah, he does, because I say it and look at him. Maybe Hartley is Cinnamon's middle name. <laughs> 957 uh, says you need a stamp set for grandparents there. I would love to see what you You know what? With. Oh, my goodness. Mm. I need my notepad. I don't feel right right now without my writing pad because y'all got some really good ideas. Oh, Gil Richie, thank you so much. Tracy, you have outdone yourself. I appreciate that. I appreciate that. You you want, I want y'all to love the stamps and I want y'all to not, not, when you get them, I don't want you to just put them away somewhere. I want you to be using these like as your, the stamp sets that you just love and you can't get enough of it and you want to use it over and over. Especially when we start accommodating. Gil Richie says, I can't wait to see what you come out with next. We got some stuff. I can't stop thinking about ideas and the stuff y'all been sending us too. Y'all have been sending some great oh, ideas. Sineda says, well, I can't go get my to March. She's leaving for California on Monday. I'll be gone to the first of March. Well, be safe, Sineda. Yes, be safe. Uh-oh, Dania says congratulations on the new stamp set i have four dogs and my whole family loves hartley oh I my placed goodness. my order yesterday for the spring stamp set and i'll be ordering this one tonight thank you dad dania for that tremendous support taz holden just gets us closer to the next one right <laughs> it does do you think you are going to make stickers well now that's another option right we'll have to write that down especially because stickers are something i love so i want i want to make the things that i love you know Oh, thank you so much. Y'all are just so sweet. Too Sweet for BS says, I cannot think of two people who deserve wonderful things more than you and Bill. You both are a blessing to each of us that watches. Thank you so much. We appreciate that. Um, life gets tough sometimes, but you have to get up and keep going. <laughs> you got to get up and keep going. You're and sometimes same. when you're going in the right direction... Certain things happen, like you get a tooth pull, your glasses break, you know, things like you know, that. Like people, you know, <laughs> Tracy used to always say, if you can look up, you can get up. And I've heard people say, well, what if you fall on your face? And you know what? Then you have to add the part, then turn over, then look up, then <laughs> and get, get up. up. But you're right. going to not, don't stay down. Yep, don't stay down. Hold up. Let Lori Bolkatin, I hope I said it right, says, are your stamps photopolymer? Yes, they, yes are. they are. And why does she ask that question? Because photopolymer is the best. It, they are the the best quality. They stick. They really stick onto your um, acrylic block. There's the, no the smearing. Stamping is very crisp and clear, and they're long lasting. That's the other thing. Oh yes. If, if they're too rubbery, they start to expand and kind of get kind of the shape is not there anymore. So you want it to be a good um, stamp. And they're, the nice thing is that they're manufactured here in the United States. So um, our manufacturing company is close to us, which is a great thing. <laughs> Jennifer Pinnell, you said, since, since watching your channel, I feel like I cannot get enough stamp sets. And Melody Culbertson was one of them that got me started and introduced me to your channel. Thank you. Thank you so much. Oh, and you're on our Facebook page too. Awesome. Who is that? This is um, Jennifer Pinnell. Oh, there you go. Hi, Jennifer Pinnell. Y'all are like family. Sineda says, are they for sale now? Yes, they are. Yep. They're in there now. You can go there right now. And a bunch of y'all have been By in the there. By the time you get back in March, <laughs> they'll be there. Well, we hope, right? Oh, yes. Sure. I know. Well, I don't know. We'll just order Look, some that's more. Bill saying that. I, you know, <laughs> he didn't get enough of stuff in a bunch of envelopes. 
and looking crazy at the uh, post office. Oh my goodness, we were for days. <laughs> I mean, there were about a four or five day stretch. We stayed up. I thought we were up long the first time until about five in the morning. The next day, I'm talking about yesterday. Oh, yesterday, <laughs> yesterday wasn't too bad. It was only about three. Look at him, three thirty. <laughs> yeah, so. Yeah, I'll have to go back and write down some stuff. I'm looking at all of y'all, looking at what my family is saying here. Senator says, how does she order? Well, there you go. Here, I just put the link. Bill just put the link in there. Bam! Bam! So we crafted live last night. Oh. Um, so just make sure that you uh, go back and look at that live and see what we made using that spring blossom stamp set. We were doing these little cards here. And that's the other stamp set. But I'm going to have fun using like several stamp sets together to create one card, which is going to be real fun. That's one of the things I love doing, taking different stamp sets and creating a card using those. So we're going to go ahead and head off here. Oh, we're not ready yet, babe? Yeah, no, Bill is like, no, don't go. He's like, no. <laughs> okay, well, there you go. Well, our evening is going to be processing orders because we like to get them out to you as soon as we like to process as soon as possible um, so that we can get them in the mail to you. And, and I was shocked that several of y'all wrote us already and said that um, you got your stamp sets and you're getting ready to use them. So... Wow. <laughs> oh, someone wants to know if I'm going to craft live tonight with Hartley. Y'all must be, aren't y'all like done with us now? Don't y'all get tired of us? <laughs> Are you going to craft tonight live with Hartley? I don't know. Are you going to do that? Bill, what do you think? Do something little. Like uh, one of those see. miniature cards. One of the smaller... Okay, look. Now, y'all, this is the one thing about lives. It's so upfront. that it can I grab <laughs> with Hartley? Uh. Let's see what we can come up with. Since y'all are in love with little Hartley... As John says, it's a Friday night date with all of us. Oh, too sweet for BS. Says don't you are the extended family. Y'all actually are. Y'all are. Uh, forget about extended. Y'all, <laughs> y'all are in the family. Okay. Lisa Christian says, remember this to thumbs up this video. Oh, Jay Johnson says, shout out my friend Bernie Gers. It's his birthday. Happy birthday, Bernie Gers. <laughs> Ah, happy birthday. Have a wonderful, wonderful, enjoyable birthday. And don't do anything we wouldn't do. There you go. Gives you plenty of options. No, it doesn't. Okay, <laughs> stab in the dark. Ah. <laughs> yep. Okay, so someone said, am I going to do something? And White is right. She says, don't wait. They may be sold out. Yeah, because Bill, show. yeah, we, we actually <laughs> underestimated. The state, you want to like when you're first starting your business, you want to kind of be conservative a little bit and you're ordering till you know. And then it was like, man, y'all really. <laughs> we still have some stuff. Though. Yeah. But, but. Right. Please. Okay. So um, I'm going to go for it. This is very unplanned. So it's, it's definitely mindless. Well, there you go. She's taking my little heart lead. And Bill's going to read the comments. I will. Too soon for BSS. She's headed to dinner with the hubby, but so happy to have caught you. Well, oh, thank nice. Thank you for coming, Too Sweet. Hartley, let's see. Hartley needs to be... Um, let's see what we got here. A very light, light shade.
Okay, y'all. I'm going for it with Hartley here. Y'all can color him in any color. I mean, you want to go with some, some people go with the browns and the gray dogs and the black dog, you know. But you can, the nice thing about stamp sets is you can do this in any color you want. That's true. And you do. Yep. Go for it. I can't wait to see what y'all come up with. Okay. You gotta stay true blue, huh? We're trying to. Bill's gonna dress the lighting for me, so y'all can see okay on this. Look at that adorable face. He is just. I can just color him like all day long. Just. He's so adorable. And I'm using my Tumbo markers, which right now are my favorites. 957 says purple. purple. I have a purple Hartley. Oh, you do, don't you? Where is he? I, I was trying to do something different. Here's the purple one, which is so cute. <laughs> He's so cute. Here's one surrounded by purple. Too sweet for BSS. I would, if I lived near you, I would come help you to stuff envelopes. Oh, come on. <laughs> Will you reorder Hartley? Um, I think Hartley would be one that we would have to reorder. Oh, yeah. Uh, we're still making decisions about what we'll reorder. Um, but what happens, is, which is nice is about our Shopify store is if we start to run low, y'all can actually put in your email. If we run out of something... But we'll be looking at it anyway because it tells us what our inventory is. So it, it has an inventory tracker for us as well. And once we order it, I think it will remind them or something. It will let them know that we have it. Is that how it works? It will let them know when it's back in stock, yes. Mm -hmm. That's a nice thing. Well, don't need to worry too, sweet. Right now we have Hartley. Yeah, Hartley just got here today. So ho hopefully we still have him after the weekend because <laughs> y'all just... <laughs> oh, Pat Jones says, can you show us the brush end of those Tombow markers? Yes, I, I sure can. I love those ends. You see, look, now this one right here, here's the other end. So it's a dual brush marker. I didn't know it had two ends. Yeah, it's got the little tiny one here. Now, if I wanted to go around here, let me see. I'm going to I'm gonna just show you on this right Hold quick. While she gets ready to Wait, wait, it. wait. Let me just put this right here. See, I can do little stitching with this if I wanted to. So you have this one, which gives it... This this is the one I like because you can, you see how that is. This just gives you def, more definite lines. Can, can let me say something right quick. Mm -hmm. uh, Wait, who asked that question? Pat. Pat. Listen, I'm not a good colorer. If you can see the end of this thing right here, how pointed it is. Using this thing, someone like me, an absolute novice, I feel like a pro. It, it, this tip allows me to stay inside the lines. With, I'm, I'm not even trying. You hear my husband who says he's not a craft. No, no, no. That's what I'm saying. It's not <laughs> me doing it. It's those tumble markers. Look, if it I use something did. normal, I'd be, I'd be struggling. What Believe did I me. say was your most important craft tool? Oh, thank you, Mary Lynn Cobb. She just ordered Harley and the Spring Blossom set. Oh, sweet. The nice thing about these, though, I love the fact that I can go in. And it's almost like using a, a paintbrush. And I can darken up the colors, you know, just by layering. Hartley is adorable, y'all. I think this is going to be a favorite. And don't forget, love is all year round. I'm going to wait 365 days until February 14th and say it that one day and that's it. <laughs> You won't be coming back here. That's what she was thinking. Okay. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> okay, so he looks really good in blue. I don't know if I tried him in blue yet. Wow. See, this is the nice thing is that you get to kind of play and experiment. And Hartley, look at his little wisp of hair. Okay, so how Hartley came to be is I was sitting down with my illustrator, John. 
and I told him what the vision was that I wanted for the stamp set. And he said, well, why not do a heart dog? And I'm like, heart dog? I was like, oh, I don't know. He was like, let me, let me show you. And boy, am I glad that he showed me what he came up. So I get to sit and I watch him draw. And I'm like, it's almost Ooh. like a live tutorial sitting right there with an artist. Sineda Rodriguez, she just ordered hers. So when you, when you come back, you'll have something waiting. There you go, Sineda. Unless you send it to where you're going, then it'll be waiting on you when you get there. Look how adorable. <laughs> so you see, I'm just going in and just adding just a little bit of darker shading, just in certain areas here. And then if I want, I have other colors of other shades of blue, so I can darken it up even more if I wanted to. Look how dark that is. So right under here where his heart meets his little legs over there, I can go in. You can match up color. You can do the ears in one color, the face in another color, you know, the little heart paws <laughs> in another color. So it's just up to you. There's no limitations with this. Mindless crafting, right? Too sweet. But BS says, Tracy, I hope you sell out over and over. I hope you do too, Tracy. No, thank you, Too Sweet. <laughs> Bill's gonna come on here and do some uh some cards too. He said he is. I he's, am. He's been busy though. He's been working on getting that. Melanie Corperson is on here. Hey Melanie. Hi, Melanie. Look at that. Oh my goodness. So you see what I'm doing? I'm just kind of going in in little places here and just giving him just a little bit more shading. Uh oh, Jennifer Pennell says, my husband said he doesn't have a crafting bone in his body. And I told him that he needed to make cards with me because Bill uh -oh, crafts Bill. too. Blame it on Bill. <laughs> Ah, that's is that is too well, I funny. I have to. I'll get kicked out of the house. That is too funny. No, you won't, babe. Okay. I think you enjoy it, though. <laughs> I think he enjoys it, babe. <laughs> oh, Warmer Keith. She says she's back. She just ordered both stamps. Oh, awesome. Oh, Ron, thank Ron. you. I love Ron Marquise. Okay, I do. I love all of her. I love them all. Too. I love everyone. All of our followers. Actually, I do. I feel like I know these people. I know. It's just I like, like I know it's like y'all are our I neighbors. See, once you start seeing them, you start getting insight into their personality and mm -hmm. what they say. Yeah. And I think they know us too somewhat. They do. Look at that. See, I'm just shading it in, going in darker. That's the beauty of these Tombow markers is that you can just kind of do your own thing. Look, y'all. <laughs> I'm trying not to do it. I was going to do stitching, and I'm really trying not to. She um, can't. She's going to stitch that thing, buddy, okay? Um, pass me that paper over there. Since we're just kind of, we're the, actually have, someone requested that I make something <laughs> using Hartley. So now y'all got me up in here making a card. <laughs> and I don't have anything prepared. And guess what? You don't have to be prepared sometimes. Sometimes you just got to get working, okay? Just get to work and start doing it. Get to playing. Not get to work. You know get what? to playing. Okay. Let me cut this You know down. what, uh, uh, Gil Ritchie? Uh, here's the question. She says, Bill, if I order the stamp set now, can you hold up on posting it to the hotel for two weeks? I don't want to chance them being sold out if I leave it. Mm. Actually, I can do that. I can. I can do that. I'll just go ahead and order it. And I will put a note to myself. Oh, yes, you can do that. Can That's do right. That. Yep, you can. Yep. Our Shopify store, we love it. Okay. We love it. Um, it does. It can do so many things. And guess what? The people at Shopify, they know us <laughs> very well because if we have a question, we're going to ask, okay? If y'all give us a question and we don't know it, yeah. 
So this oval, for those of you who are just tuning in, let's see. This oval comes from this right here. Just so y'all know, <laughs> this was a frame. I told my daughter, I was like, Ariel, I need a um, I need an oval shape. And she was like, Mom, that frame that sits on your shelf is an oval. And I was like, what? So I pulled out the little packaging on the inside. See? Everything is a craft tool. <laughs> Everything. So let me get some paper. Um, I'm trying to go through my spring paper pack. So y'all bear with me as I get some paper here now. Uh, uh, Let's see what we got here. The email address is on the website, isn't it? Admin at put in here. mindlesscrafting.com. See, Hartley needs to be, you know, I have a paper pack. <laughs> this is what happens when y'all have me kind of crafting, freestyle crafting, which actually most of my crafting is freestyle. And Bill is actually blocking part of my shelf, so. Y'all bear with me while I find my stuff. Hartley, let's see. Hartley needs some kind of background paper. We're gonna hook Hartley up. Because, let's see what we got here. We need something for Hartley. Hartley is going to be spring-like, you know? Hartley is going to be... Hi, Neil. Naomi Custodi Custodio. I hope I said her name right. You better, because Naomi sent us those... Um, Naomi, he better get Ooh, your name I right. I it, didn't I? Because he used to send us um, <laughs> that candy from Puerto Rico. It was gone, buddy. Look, hey. my husband... <laughs> Ready to move now. He don't know your name, okay. I do, <laughs> <laughs> Naomi Custodio. Hopefully, he pronounced that right. Yeah, he enjoyed that candy. Patricia Ross said, Stitching, stitching. Oh, the stitching, believe me, Patricia, the stitching will be. Coming. I know, I know. I'm trying not to, but guess what? <laughs> that is her trademark. Ah, uh, when in doubt. Oh, stitch it out. Okay, she with okay. I'm going to cut this a little bit shorter. Let's go with five. I'm not. I'm not thinking about this, y'all. I'm just doing it. So let's go ahead and five. I'm going to do more than one. I'm going to do. I'll save this for more than one card, though. But four. One of the things I don't like doing is measuring, for real. <laughs> because you got to think about it. <laughs> All right. Your Richie. There you go. Where's your book? Okay, so. I remember. Ooh, that's going to. Look at that paper. This is a really light, more scrapbook type paper, but hey, you could throw this on a card too. And let me just, it's one thing to craft live, but it's another thing to craft live, um, <laughs> to craft, it's one thing to craft, another thing to craft live, period, just, there's a lot that, um, but I feel like y'all are family, and if I make, a, well, we don't make mistakes in crafting, do we? Never mind then. Scratch that. <laughs> I was going to say if I make a mistake. <laughs> I don't think we're going to do that. Now I need my big scissors. Let's see. Let me get my big old scissors. Diane 57 says she just ordered her sets. Oh, nice. Thank you, Diane 57. Awesome sauce. I'm going to get, look, I'm getting rid of this. I'm going to just free, freehand this right now. <laughs> I 
I'll have to add some pretty ribbon on here too. Because Hartley, Hartina, did we come up a name with a name for the um, female version of Hartley? Hortense? <laughs> Similar to Hortense, Hortense, Bill, are you listening? Yes, I <laughs> My am. husband is over here typing. <laughs> uh, I hope y'all can see this okay. Okay. So you see what happens when you put that background on it, right? Perfect. All right, let's go ahead and get some glue here. There's certain tools in my craft room that just never go away. <laughs> they're, they're here all the time. Like, they just don't get put up. It's glue. That's everything in here. My fussy cut scissors. You said it's everything. <laughs> <laughs> Bill, why are you throwing me under the bus? <laughs> Bill throwing me under the tractor trailer, okay. Ooh, too much of that on there. So Hartley needs to be in the flowers. Hartley's gonna be in the flowers, y'all. Liza Christian said, just told her my son some of Bill's uh, language, humpers, over blingified, <laughs> uh, exactitudes. He's, <laughs> he's roofing. Okay, look, look at this right here. I, I, I said, uh, look, Trace, let me find it. Uh, I told uh, Gil, I said, oh, when you goodness. ordered email me at such and such, and we can lock down on the exactitudes <laughs> of the exactly. transaction. Exactitudes. They know what I'm talking about. <laughs> Exactitudes. Set. Bill is coming up with his own. The exactness the, and the, the latitude. Like, it's a combination. The parameters. The, longi the longitude, the latitude, and then the Yes, exactitude. they know. <laughs> <laughs> ah, that's funny. I'm, I'm actually over here looking for some ribbon, y'all. Y'all got me all up in the craft room looking for some ribbon. Oh, tired old mom. <laughs> Greetings from freezing cold Michigan. You know what? I used to live there, so I feel your pain. Mm. I hey, I remember having to shovel the snow Ooh, three times a day, okay? Twice in the morning, because my mother and father both left to work at an hour and a half intervals. And then in the evening after the city pushed all the snow back into the driveway. I mean a mountain of it. So I'd have to come and get it all out all over again. Do I miss the snow? No, nope. I do not. <laughs> he sure does not. Oh, I'd have a site called, I'd call myself Tired tired Old Dad. <laughs> <laughs> that, that'd be my funny. name on here, okay? Okay, so here's what I'm going with, y'all. I made a decision. I looked and looked and looked over there to find some, and then I just came back to what I originally should have gone with. I'm going to put stitching on that card. <laughs> y'all sound surprised. I can hear y'all now. You like there's something okay. new. <laughs> I'm going to put you stitching on this. You like just decided this. for this one time, and this one time only. <laughs> I think I'm going to put stitches. <laughs> uh, don't get my husband started on Friday night. This is this is date night for us, okay? Friday night. And and y'all, I'm still saw saw. In the uh -oh. jaw, saw in the jaw. Don King Arena. <laughs> Wait a minute. Saw in the jaw because I had my tooth pulled on Monday. So all this laughing is not helping. <laughs> Y'all are funny. Okay, so I'm just using regular tape to put on there. Yep. Now for my art glitter glue. Melanie Culberson is not been crafting all week because she has uh, she has three discs, Tracy, that are killing her. Back. Oh man! Go to take care. Talk Thank about you. pain level, Melanie. I hope you feel better soon. That Denise Glisson, I guess she she thinks like you. She says, "Why put away this stuff if you're just gonna use it?" You know what? It yeah, basically. <laughs> Basically, it needs stitching. 
Dio Richie says, Dio, here's the thing. Here's the thing. Like when you say stuff like exactitude and overblingify, here's uh -huh. the real thing. We understand you. <laughs> exactly. That's the scary thing. You know, there's a site called, I think it's called the Urban Dictionary. If you go in there, you will see that's probably where my words are in there. Now, I don't even have to look at it. I'm telling you, they're in I there. I was going to say, you don't have an Urban Dictionary. He's like, I know, I, I am the walking. Well, what happened? I put one of my words in and it came right to the UrbanDictionary.com or something like that. Like blingify? I bet it's in there. Mm. If not, I need to put it in there and tell them, hey. <laughs> well, just make Bill's dictionary, okay? Bill's crafty words. There you go. Oh, that's a good one. Ron Marquis says, don't forget turkey roll, sparkly stuff, stick thing, <laughs> and Tracy's. <laughs> wipe off, wife off, not wife off. Wife offable, offable It's called crafts. wife offable. W I F E. W I spell it for you. Offable. <laughs> Ron, you've been following us too long if you still remember that. Exactly. Now, when y'all see that word, that doesn't that mean something <laughs> to y'all. It's wife offable, not wipe offable. Here is the difference. Oh, my goodness. My jaw is hurting. Y'all need to stop. Um, where are my, look, I was going to say, where are my, um, where are my humpers? <laughs> oh, you didn't put the humpers on? I'm going to put them on now. Okay, there you go. Okay, I need to get more. Let's There's go. Ariel. One thing you never run out of. Ariel's looking at me like, give me my computer. <laughs> give me my computer. Right now. Mimi B, your brother and I are soul brothers, okay? <laughs> she says, my brother's made up his own words for years. <laughs> he has had all of us saying it. Other people have no clue what we're what talking, we're talking about. about. Only people inside the family. It's like your own language, huh? Well, you know, it's kind of like kids. I bet, hold up, everyone experiences this. Think about it. If you have kids and you see them fighting, arguing, you say, what's wrong? They say something like, he he took my thing. And you'll say, give me his thing back. <laughs> he got the thingy wing. Get the thingy wingy. And you and know then, exactly what it is, right? Right. Then someone comes and what's he doing? He took the thingy wingy. What? He took the thingy wingy. Get the thingy wingy back. <laughs> now, if someone heard you from outside the household, they would call child services or something. They would say, what is wrong <laughs> with this family? <sighs> yeah, That's we we works. pretty much know exactly what that thing is, <laughs> whatever it is we're talking about. It's like your own language inside the family. Okay, so. Ooh, Adrian Hall says, Tracy, thanks to you, I decided to create a template and use my Cricut Maker to cut out multiple shapes from leftover cereal boxes to use in my oh, card crafting. Oh, nice. Good idea. Good idea. I'm sure someone else is going to love that idea, too. Okay, so I need to leave, I need to put a sentiment on this one. Put a sentiment on this. Hmm. Ooh, Peggy. Sentiment. Peggy's setting up her Shopify right now. Peggy, oh, Peggy Lori. Welcome to the club. Peggy. Ooh, Peggy for to do some damage. Okay. I'm gonna tell him be you. We're gonna use that. Be you. Because you just don't want to be anyone else. Be yourself, right? That's true. So this is gonna be my message. Heart dog is, is being himself. <laughs> I was telling someone one time. Um I was talking to this one girl. She, she was talking about. I just can't seem to find the man of my dreams. I said, "Why not?" She says, "I don't know." She said, "I I got my hair done like uh, like Holly Berry. I did the so and so workout. <laughs> I got the clothes from the so and so collection. I have the this." She was naming all these different things. I said, "No wonder you can't find a man." She said, "What do you mean?" I said, "Because by the time he sees you." He's someone else is there. <laughs> he can't find you. Oh, Bill, you're funny. <laughs> well, there you go. And that's one of Bill's nuggets in a nutshell, right? <laughs> oh, that's funny. Tonight I says it's 13 degrees of gusting winds where she is. Where is Sinada? My goodness. It's windy here. It's been windy today. 
Yesterday it was 80. Today it's a little bit colder. Isn't that crazy? And about a week ago, it was so cold. Yep. I didn't even feel like moving. Belinda Walter says, I have just come to the conclusion that my craft room is never going to be organized and straight. <sighs> so today, y'all, card making <laughs> is going to be the activity today. There you go. And how does that differ from the other days when it's still not straightened? <laughs> <laughs> That's the question on the table, okay? <laughs> <laughs> Bill, you're too funny. Okay, y'all, I'm making my little my little sign here. See, even Denise Glisson says her her husband and her apparently they have the same kind of conversations inside their house or outside, and people look at them like. What are you talking and then about? if Bill doesn't understand what I'm talking about, I'm like, Bill, did you not see my face? He's like, yeah, but I still didn't know what you were talking about. <laughs> no, let me tell you something. He's supposed to know exactly I, what I'm talking I, I, about. 99.9% of the time, I know exactly what she's saying. Even her face shows no visible right. expression to, to anyone else. Exactly. I can read it, baby. Supposed to be. Okay? That's the way it's supposed to be. I'm trained. Okay, so we're gonna, just going to put... Ron Marquis says, heart dog looks good among the spring flowers and with stitching. Doesn't he? Yes. Ooh, you're going to put some of them dots. You got to put some of those blue dots on the outside. Ooh, you, you know what I'm talking about right there? Around him? Like here? No, around here. Like, those those uh, dots kind of like that thing right there. Let's see. Yeah. Or like this one. No. no like, oh, you want like the dots? Happy spring. Okay, Bill is having a conversation. See, he, here's what ends up happening is that I put he, the minus part on. He you. don't want to do the card. <laughs> <laughs> I'm doing the side, the passenger. He'd be like, I'll just read the comments, which he's not doing right now. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I'm trying to sneak that in <sighs> because I'm helping you. Thank you, darling. You need help. <laughs> <laughs> I do need help. Okay, <laughs> y'all help me. Okay, this is a secret message. SOS for help, okay? <laughs> if y'all ever see me create an SOS stamp set, just oh. know it's a silent message, okay? <laughs> the cry for help stamp set. <laughs> Bill's like, is this supposed to mean something? Bill's giving me this look right now like, okay, what's she talking about? <laughs> Ooh. What? I like B U, B, B U, exactly. Ron Marquis, she says Bill is just being inspirational. He really is. <laughs> exactly, <sighs> Ron. Y'all are too funny. Quietness. Y'all are so quiet. <laughs> Ron, actually, Ron just got a new crafting tool. She did? Yes, she did. What did she get? Ron, did you get a cuddle bug? What is that? Ron. <laughs> Read her message. She's about to tell you. You said what well, she was. You remember the thing you speaking. that was the thing that you saw in the store, and you was like, Tracy, we need to get you that. That's what that was. Oh, yeah. it was that. Um. Oh, that one thing that's kind of heavy. Die cut. Yeah. Oh yeah. Okay. There you go. Gymnastics one on one says very cute. Love your mindless crafting. I know y'all really put me on the spot. Hartley is just a. Adorable. Jackal what do y'all think? Here. Do y'all think right here or here? Uh -oh. <laughs> like, uh oh. <laughs> what do you I... think, everybody? What should she do? You tell her. Hartley is adorable. Let's see. Uh, Whatever it is. Happens to it. It's top. To Pat Jones says top. Oh, that does look cute. Yeah, at an angle. That was quite cute. Yeah, I like, I like putting things at angles. I, I don't like them like just straight. Right, on, it's too you know? symmetrical. It's like 
in life, in life, I mean, it's like you be rigid. I don't want to be rigid. I want to have. I want to live my life at an angle. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Catch you off guard. And believe me, y'all, he really has been. Hmm. Uh, what are you trying to say? <laughs> <laughs> I might have stepped into all that kind one. of angles. Okay, <laughs> you'll be dizzy. <laughs> I have top, bottom, top on the ribbon, bottom on angle, on a ribbonless cue, top. Joanne Gilbertson said, hi, Joanne Gilbertson. Hey, Joanne Gilbertson. She says, just beautiful. Adrian Hall, that's what I'm saying, sideways, kind of at an angle off center. Now, Bill wants me to take this stuff right here. Bill Richie says, slant oh, at the top though. with bling on the ribbon. That would look cute on there. It would. Rip it off now, quick. No, kidding. I would have to make one. Hmm. Look over there and see if you see one of the flowers. Okay, I'm really being crafty uh, here, y'all. This is I do. mindless crafting. Take um, that one. That one doesn't have... Doesn't have what? Okay, Bill wants me to use this right but here. you can recolor from the, something. From the other stamp set. You know what? You're right, babe. This, this, is, this is actually some of the stuff from the other, the Grow and Blossom stamp set. I'm going to take this flower right here. You can and combinate. And I'm going to add it in. I'm going to put it somewhere on here. I'm going to make it dimensional. I'm going to dementify it. Uh oh. <laughs> That's what Bill would say. I'm going to dementify it. <laughs> no, I'll probably say dementialize. <sighs> oh, my goodness. He, he like wants that. me to dementialize this. Hold up. So, Nate is from Saginaw, Michigan. I know you're not from Saginaw, Michigan. That's why it's so cold. Sonata, you from Saginaw? Please yes, tell me no. you're not. You... Wait a minute. Oh, wait a minute. Hold as on. long as we've known Sonata, you didn't know she was from? No, not Saginaw. Okay, so this one is already done here. So now Hartley becomes, Hartley is moving into spring now. You see how versatile the stamp is? Hartley is moving into spring, babe. Anama Rahu says, I recently watched your first video on your channel. It's amazing to see how far you guys have come. Oh my goodness, you really want to see how far we come. You should see the other channel, Little Storybook. The first video oh my was goodness. so we pathetic. Had, I had, had no video. Idea. It was video all was faded <laughs> in the middle of the channel. It, wasn't even, it didn't even fit the screen. I had no idea whatsoever. <sighs> yeah, it, it's been a journey, right? <laughs> but well, guess what happens? Here's what happens. You grow and you blossom. <laughs> just saying. Bill, I'm just saying. Yeah, that first video was <clears throat> actually at my kitchen table showing someone how to make a gift basket. That was my first video on the channel. Oh, Joni Montgomery says, I didn't see a link in the description for the stamp set. I will be happy to show you that. Um, this, there you go. There's the link. Okay, so this flower is from the um, Growing Blossom stamp set. I'm sorry, the Spring Blossom stamp set. Y'all got me crafting and trying to do all kinds of stuff here. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this flower because I think it needs to be over here somewhere or something. Somewhere. <laughs> somewhere. So I'm looking for my, my things. Where are my things, babe? <laughs> Okay, so let's see if we have, I need to order more of these. I've used, I've had these for a while now and I, I need to order more because, just because, that one's too big. Let's see, mindless crafting y'all. Jaquiel Shield says they're in Texas freezing I thought Texas so hot you could fry an egg or something like that. I know in the summer, but surely, right now, this is gonna be this is gonna be cute. Be cold. I got I gotta make this um I gotta make that dimensional. You do. What do y'all think? Yes, the well, Kathleen well, German. I understand Buffalo, New York. You would have to be cold. Okay, let me get my um. Naomi says she's ordering tonight. Thank you. Let me get my stuff out here. I'm gonna have to. Line is 30 C, 33 says, Bill, do you have a twin? <laughs> if you're very lucky, I don't. No, but seriously, no. He's an original, <laughs> y'all. Okay, so I'm going to make this dimensional 
um, because I feel like this needs a dimensional flower on my heart dog, right? So I'm going to make the same one I made last night or something similar. And I'm just going to, this is what happens when y'all ask me to craft like right off of the, off the top of my head here. So we're turning Hartley, we're making Hartley spring. We're doing a spring Hartley theme here. And so what I'm doing is, this was one of the flowers I had already done. And I am going to, I think this is too Damn. stiff. This paper is too stiff. So guess what I'm going to do, y'all? What are you going to do? I'm going to wet it. What? She's wetting. She's wetting. And why are you doing paper? That? She's using because I need it to On be a purpose, little bit more. Even. Um, I need to be more. More wet. Flexible, like oh, when I'm okay. when I'm using this right here. Marjorie Ryan says you're doing amazing. Thank you. So you see how that's. This is like a surgeon. You're doing like that's like a scalpel. And I'm yeah, and I'm using this piercing mat, but you can use. Some people use the. Uh, the, the mouse, mouse pad. pad. Bill, you remember. I remember. Who, who said up, they did that? Look at my husband. One of you said that you well, I was. That. I know a lot of people had suggested it. So another thing you want to do is just, I want to cut this in a little bit more because I want my petal to kind of really curl up. And so if I cut just a little bit more into the flower, I like towards, how the, cut towards the center, it, it just makes it a little bit easier for the, for the petals to kind of do good. their 3D thing. And by the time you do that squirrely technique thing, it almost looks like real petals. Right. So you want your petals to kind of be a little bit isolated here. So now is where the magic happens. Am I within the frame there? Just want to make sure. I think you are. There's stuff all over this room right now. Bill's going to help me. <laughs> <laughs> He's going to help me organize and clean up. <laughs> I will get two, three garbage bags and uh... and lay on the couch. <laughs> <laughs> you can't make this stuff up. <laughs> you just trying to beat me to the punch. Okay? You just can't make this stuff up. <laughs> so y'all see what's happening here? It's starting to <laughs> crafting is Ooh, supposed to be serious. <laughs> Kathleen German says, "What about a squirrel stamp? That'd be a good one." Oh, Kathleen German, that'd be a great one. I like squirrels. Me too. From afar, yes. <laughs> but they're so cute. A squirrel bit my grandfather's so finger one time. I should have been upset, but he had just spanked me. <laughs> I mean, those days, their spankings, they had switches. So they called it spanking. I called it something else. So the squirrel bit his finger. I was actually happy. I shouldn't have been. I should be ashamed of myself for admitting something like that. But at the moment, I really was. I was giving find myself crying. Yeah! And when it happened, you're like, <laughs> And you go right from crying to laughing. That's what happened to me. Oh, yes, let's make a squirrel stamp so, set. So this tool right here, and I was letting Bill have a mo his moment with his, with his squirrel. This tool right here. <laughs> I forgot the name of this tool. <laughs> <laughs> it's the sticky thing, the pokey tool. No, this is not the, the pokey tool. The search and the scalpel. I, look, I was trying to wait till he had his moment and get all of his words She was out. having a senior moment. <laughs> and okay. now I can't remember what this is called. Y'all help me out. Stylus tool. It's a stylus. Yeah. So you see how that's really curling up now? Look at that, y'all. Let's see if y'all can really see that. Let me, let me put this in my palm of my hand. So y'all can really see the way that's curling up. Now you can get some dimension in there. And that see how that, that water makes it. Now when it dries, it gets a real stiff, kind of rigid kind of feel to it. So now we're going to pop our little gem in there. Gil Richie says a new baby stamp set in a new home. Ooh. Yeah, though, I think Tracy has something about... I have that one. About, yeah, I have that yeah. home. That new home one is yeah, on my new list. Home yeah, one. But a new baby one would be kind of cool. That would be cute, too. Ron says, she's surprised you didn't name the dog Cinnamon or Gooby. Actually, the people... I, I, you know what? <laughs> they you named, named him it. Hartley. You okay. all named him before we could even Right, we pick didn't even, anything. the stamp set only came out two days ago and the, immediately <laughs> Hartley was the name. And it sounded so cute. I didn't even have a chance to think of nothing else. Okay, so do I ask y'all where the flower needs to be? Because <laughs> I would look cute, kind of, mm -hmm, you know. What's that? How's that, babe? 
That's wonderful. Bill, you ain't even look over here talking about that's wonderful. I don't have to look you, because all your stuff is he's, wonderful. He's typing in the comments. That's wonderful. Um, hello. All your stuff <laughs> is. Over here. <laughs> See, I know the right stuff to say. I'm he not does. crazy. Okay. After 12 years of marriage, he knows the right stuff to say. Well, I learned early in the game. Yeah, you did. I think Tracy asked me something like, how do these pants look? I said, they look good. They, they, they look pretty good. Oh, they didn't look good before? I don't ask me <laughs> no more. Uh, I'm not answering nothing. No, how do these pants look? Are you oh, trying they look to say great. I'm I don't have pants crazy. Look. I don't mm -hmm. have pants on. I have a skirt. He wasn't paying attention. <laughs> 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 yeah, so. Oh, Jaquille Shield said those stamps are so cute. Where can I get them? I'm putting the link in, Jaquille. Bam! There you go. So, this is the stamp that we're working with, but um, the other stamp, let's see. Let me get that. Um, that flower's from the spring stamp set. Oh, let me put these gems. Look at my stuff. Look at this. This is where things gather until I can put them away. They've gathered for almost a year now, y'all. <laughs> mm, they have. And I, I, I know where everything is inside that little thing. I know what's in there. I know what's in there. Okay, so I'm just kind of pulling some gems. And Bill is going to pass me the other stamp set so they can I see am? it. It's Where? somewhere under there. What, what kind of stamp set? The spring blossom. Oh. <laughs> the one you helped to create? That one. <laughs> okay, hold uh. up. I will. So, yeah, we're just plugging away here, doing some stuff. I'm looking for something right now, so. I don't see it. I'll look for it, babe. You're not going to find it. I sure are. And you like to rough things up a little bit. So so I can't have you roughing up my papers. <laughs> so I have to leave town. Yes, he will. Are you sure it's here? Bill, yes, it is here. Oh. Let me get that one. So that's the one for the um, the Love You stamp set, which, which has become Hartley stamp set. And is that the one? I'll go get one. Other one, and I was playing with that thing all day. You would think I know what it is. Please. <laughs> <laughs> oh, here it is. Bill's gonna. I was gonna run downstairs. Before I went downstairs. You know, I should have just let you run downstairs anyway, though, right? <laughs> that would have been terrible. That's the spring blossom stamp set. So that's the one that's making this flower right now. Clear. Yeah. So that's the one that's making the flower, and this is the one we're working with, and that's there's Hartley, adorable, <laughs> adorable Hartley. Okay, so I didn't even get to read what they said as far as the flower. Oh, lioness! She said oh, she lost lioness. her husband years ago, and you remind me of him. Oh, sweet. Oh. Hopefully, yeah, I was looking, something favorable. Yeah, I'm sure it was. He must have had you in stitches, okay? Because this man right here, he has us cracking up. Bottom right, I think it should go in the bottom right, too. So, here we go. Patricia Ross says, show both stamps. Oh, you did show both stamps, didn't you? That's why I was sending you downstairs. Here you go. Oh, yeah, but here you go. It's better to lay them flat on the ground. Lots of, okay, babe. Lots of images on this. Um, just a ton of them. I uh, wanted to make sure y'all had a... It's hard when we're making the stamp sets. You know the hardest thing is? Which what? ones to put on the stamp set. Exactly. Because we have a lot of images that kind of goes into a folder that we might bring up later on. And all of them are so wonderful. What do we start combinating, though? Yeah. Okay, so now we've got this, this. Bill wants to put these on here. You don't think I should put them in this color, babe? Uh, Which color do you want them in? You want yeah. the blue on blue? You, I know you like blue. I do. But you can do both. Do mostly blue with some some pink. Because you have 
I don't know. Okay, we'll do pink because we have and the blue. blue. Yeah, the blue thing here. Yeah, the blue dog. Mm -hmm. But you got a pink tongue and other stuff, so you can kind of. The pink would be like the rule of thirds, but it'd be more. Than you third. hear my husband? My husband. <laughs> the rule of thirds. They know what I'm talking about. Y'all know what he's talking about, and he know what he's talking about. He's an artist. No, I've heard you say this so many times that. Well, you edit the video, so yeah, you would know. Bill Bill is a crafter. He, he's edited so many videos. 600 and something. Well, he hasn't That's edited any recently. Y'all notice we've been doing a lot of lives because of our camera. Yeah, so nice. um, <laughs> You never know if it's going to cut on. Lately, uh, most of the time it won't. But Yeah, so that's why we've been doing a whole lot of lives. I like to do the taped version stuff, too, because, you know, lives are fun, too. But um, I like to make sure that I'm putting out some recorded videos. So as soon as we're up to par, we're going to be looking at some some cameras and deciding um, which ones to get or which one. Bill said we should have two because we need a backup. We do. And we do. I don't want to ever ha not have a camera again. Let's see. This one is not squeezing out too well, so let's see. Oh, Terry Mallory, Mallory said she bought the Spring Blossom stamp the night before last, and now she just bought this one. Love your stamps. I now have your entire collection. Oh, nice. Ooh, Terry, thank you. Thank you, Terry. We appreciate it. It's good when you are hoping that people will like what you put out and what you create and y'all have um y'all have really really made us feel extremely blessed um just to be able to do this and and deliver a good product and something that's going to be fun so bill i'm doing the pink and i'm doing the blue on here Because we were on live and someone came up with this dude. Was it Karen? What was her name? Karen Shan. Wow, Bill, you remember? Okay, yeah. So she was doing this and she was like, put the dots um, inside the circle. That was that other stamp. Let me just show y'all. We had done this. Uh, that's the wreath. That, that was the wreath uh, card that we did the other night. And someone, and that was, this is making, this was made with the um, spring blossom. And we ended up putting, using these Nouveau drops inside of the circle. Because I had left it plain. And she suggested putting that inside. So you see how many crafty friends we got helping us out with cards and stuff? So this looks super adorable in person. I don't know if y'all really can see the detail on that. Yep. So many card ideas, so little time. Oh, Gil Richie has to go to bed. Gil, good night. Thank you so much. All right, Gil. Sleep tight. Okay, so I'm just kind of filling in some of these space. Put a little bit more pink in here. Hartley looks so cute. Sitting amongst dots and flowers so he looks sweet so I got to be careful now that let this dry here yeah Karen and, Chan she said she was suggested to put it outside oh right, yeah she yeah, did yeah. out here that's what I like, I like um that. wait a minute did I touch something yeah Karen that's <laughs> what I like I like the outside we did the outside and we did the inside Karen Chan she should that's what I want I like outside it's all good though Let's see what happens if we do this on the outside. There you go. I mean, it doesn't show up as much, but it can add some little details to it. I'll try it for you so that you can see. Yes, craftologist. I like that word, too. <laughs> That's a good one. Uh, what happened was Adrienne Hall says that her daughter, I can't even say it, adult's daughter, just called me and asked what I was doing when I said I was watching Tracy and Bill doing minus crafting on YouTube. She called me a craftologist. <laughs> and you're right. I started to say something. That is something I, like I would that. say. I like that word. A 
Look, I'm focused now. For some reason, squeezing these tiny little um, Nuvo drops out of this bottle is just so soothing. <laughs> I can the just keep doing that this. People get whatever, joy out whatever of it. it takes, right? <laughs> whatever makes you happy. Crafting makes me happy. Okay, so now to not smear this before it dries. Have you all done this before? I'm going to add some crystal stickles to this area right here. Just a smidgen in that heart. Hartley needs his nose done. Okay. And we're going to put a little bit around the ears here, just a smidgen. This blue looks really good. See, Hartley didn't exist, right? Sometimes you got to do something to make something exist. Sometimes some things can come into being because of you, because you thought of it. That's the wonderful thing about the human mind. It can create some unique things. Oh, I'm loving this. Bill. That's my favorite saying. I'm loving this. So what are people saying? Because I can't read <laughs> it. Saying, right. Liza Christmas says, don't over blingify it. <laughs> Look at that. Rama Key says, no touchy. Hey, that's kind of cool. It's that the sparingly used blue. This was this one, the crystal. This is the crystal. The crystal, actually, I like these because you can put it over any of the colors and it just kind of enhances it. He's going to have sparkles on his head just a little bit. What about sparkles on his... Well, no. Uh, no sparkles on the cheek. Okay. <laughs> All right. Well, there you go. So there we go. Hartley has turned into something... Quite remarkable. Beautiful. See how different that looks? Same dog, different card. This is great for spring or be you. Just telling someone, giving someone encouragement. Oh. Here's Hartley again. Hartley just has his own show, doesn't he? And there we go. And his companions. Hartley and Friends. That sounds like <laughs> sounds like a show, right? Hartley and Friends. All right. So let's see what y'all are saying. Oh, thank you. All right. The cat. I know, right? Karen it's, said, it's say something about show. that cat. <laughs> it's the Hartley show. <laughs> Karen, are you happy? There you go. Karen wanted that cat. Yeah, we knew it was coming. Wait till y'all see some of the other characters that are coming. So I hope this inspired you. I'm trying not to mess this one up. I'm going to have to put him somewhere on top that of Bill the show. Bill can't touch it. Where huh? Bill can't find it. I'll help you clean up, smear. <laughs> hmm. Uh, I'm liking that sparkly stuff. Here's okay, I gotta stop looking at Hartley. Okay. Look at that flower. Look at the detail on that flower, y'all. Can y'all see how the flower curls? So hold it right there for a second, Tracy. There it is, right there. See, look at it. See how it curls over? Yep. There you go. Adding dimension. Super cute. Well, thank y'all so much. This was fun. Hey, this thanks so for the fun. support. Thanks for the uh, thumbs up. Thanks for the inspiration. Thanks, thanks for, for motivating uh, us. By purchasing these stamp sets. Um, and thank you all for taking the time out on a Friday evening to come spend some time with us. Because you could have been doing other things. Right, babe? That's true. So we got to go eat. Time to eat. <laughs> exactly. Look, Bill's like, his eyebrows just went up. So we'll see y'all real soon. 
We've got some processing of orders to do. Um, do I don't. What do you show me? I don't know this main name. Uh, Mary Lynch Cobb says need to challenge Amy Holmes to create a card with these two sets. Oh, well, I'm not sure who that is. Amy Holmes. Who's Amy Holmes? I'm not sure, but she must be a card maker. She so must there be. you go. But there you go. All right. Okay. Well, we'll see y'all real soon. We got to go do some work so we can get y'all stamps out to you. Bye.